Hi, I'm Casey Aiken for 21 this week. Crime, or at least the perception of crime, is changing the nature of peaceful and safe Montgomery County. For years, residents have behaved under the impression that there was very little crime in the county and celebrated the high quality of our police force. But that impression is a thing of the past. Every day, there is some new headline on mymcmedia.com, the Gaithersburg Gazette, or on the Nextdoor app about some type of criminal activity. No longer is crime relegated to Silver Spring, Germantown, Gaithersburg, and Wheaton. Now the number of car thefts and stolen catalytic converters from Potomac has increased dramatically. Once crime-free Bethesda has had carjackings and armed robberies, but for me, the rising crime didn't really hit home until there was a mid-afternoon carjacking outside of the Whole Foods Market in North Bethesda. That occurred a block from my office, somewhere I walk almost on a daily basis. And for those that don't know the area, it's just a small back street. It's a small triangle of retail across from what was once White Flint Mall. I know that area. It's almost unimaginable that there would be a carjacking on those narrow streets, but appropriately containing designated bike lanes. Statistics show that violent crime is up in Montgomery County. It rose 17% down county. And in the meantime, police staffing has declined 64% since 2022, just one year. And the county council and the county executive, they have no answers. They have no clue how to fix the problem. They're more concerned about giving raises to unionized county workers so they can get reelected and saving the planet by installing 16 new electrical vehicle stations. If you want to learn more about the crime problem here in Montgomery County, tune in this week to 21 This Week on MyMCM.